it's springtime, but at my house there is still a foot of snow in some areas. So I thought in order to feel more like springtime, I need something lemony. So I am making our lemon brownies with lemon frosting. Now for this recipe, you need sugar, flour, powdered sugar, a block of cream cheese, butter, four eggs, baking powder, and some lemons. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees. Next, you're gonna take a nine by 13 pan and spray it with some cooking spray. Now for the next part, it says to use a stand mixer. Now I have something to admit to you. I don't actually own a stand mixer. I just have these. <laughs> and they work just fine. To my mixing bowl, I'm going to add one cup of butter, then I have one and a half cups of sugar. Then we're just going to mix this up. Add one egg at a time and mix in between. Now you're gonna do this for all four eggs and you're gonna mix it until it's all well combined. Next, you're gonna add just a little bit of vanilla. It says a dash, I'm doing a teaspoon. And then a half cup of lemon juice. Then just mix it up. Then we have two cups of flour, one teaspoon of baking powder, then I just have a dash of salt, and the last thing we need is lemon zest. Now, I don't use my zester very often, so you're about to go where not many people have gone before. This is my random drawer. Oh, don't cringe. All right, you can cringe if you want to. I just have so many fun things that I use that I need a place. Ooh. There it is. All right, there we go. Okay, zester. And you need just about a tablespoon of zest. Lemon zest. Mm -mm. All right, about one tablespoon. Yum, it smells so good. Then you're just gonna mix it all together again. Please hold, it's two tablespoons of lemon zest. All right. And we're just going to pour this into our prepared baking sheet or baking pan. Nine by 13, you know what I'm talking about. Then gently spread it out. Next, you're just gonna throw it in the oven at 350 degrees for 20 minutes. When it's all done, go ahead and pull it out of the oven. Now, usually you do like a toothpick test, but I'm out of toothpicks, so we just gotta do a fork test. Mmm, it's a little gooey. I think we're gonna cook it for about three more minutes. All right, I let it go in for a few more minutes. It is looking good. It might have got a little burned on the edges, so I did it like extra five minutes, maybe do like three. Now, you want this to cool completely. While it's cooling, that's the time to make the frosting. For the frosting, you're gonna use a fourth cup of room temperature butter, four ounces of cream cheese, three tablespoons of lemon juice, one tablespoon of lemon zest, and then about two thirds cup of powdered sugar. Let's mix this all together. Then you're gonna take your frosting, put it right on top of your brownies. Now I'm gonna let the frosting stiffen up just a little bit, then I'm going to cut right into them. Now you can serve them just like this, or you can add a little lemon zest on top. Now for the best part of the day, Mm, that is good. So I thought it'd be fun to let my kids try it. So the 13 year old loved it. The six year old, mm, not so much. Now the 10 year old, yeah, she thought it was a winner. Harper, the one year old, um, she liked it. Wasn't quite sure what to think, but then she, she liked it later. If you want more dessert recipes, I have plenty for you. You can find them just right up there. All right, I'll see you next time.